So I look crazy right now. It's cold as hell outside. Hence the jacket. But oh. What is up Sky Squad? Welcome back to my vlog. So uh, we're moving right now and I'm really, really, really stressed out. Super stressed out to the max, to the core. We have all these clothes, these bags of clothes and um and all this stuff this stuff that this is all getting donated over here and except that that's food my starbucks is not going to be able to come with me depressed i have all my paintings over there and we're trying to fit it all in the back of my audi which doesn't have a lot of space so on top of that this morning we filled out an application to rent a house and the application was like really really long super long and I was like oh so like the questions go yes no no yes no and I accidentally clicked that Jay's been evicted somewhere so you know on top of that messing up applications we've never been evicted before <gasps> we have to be gone by tomorrow and so our original plan was to make two trips one trip up to Sacramento today drop our stuff off and then um, make another trip with the dogs on Monday, which is tomorrow. Didn't end up happening yesterday. We basically did nothing. We didn't do anything to pack anything at all. Um, thanks to Jay. So yeah, we're cramming it all into today. Nicole Skies makes great life choices. So update, we ended up being able to condense a lot of our clothes. We had like nine bags. Now we have four, five. We have five bags now. Um, we went through all our clothes, decided and picked out things that we didn't like and things that we did like and everything else was donated so we donated like six bags I think. We have a bunch more stuff to do and I'm really stressed out but I'm not that stressed out. I'm like medium, I'm medium, medium. So I have these blow torches in the closet and you know that kind of looks kind of creepy and this one also is mine, this one was theirs. I'm gonna give them mine too, so Merry Christmas. It's a blowtorch. You guys look at this is like the garden room. Hold on. This is where all of the tools are stored. So there's a bunch of black widows in here. Good morning guys. It is the next day. It's Monday. This is the day we leave. And we worked until like 9 p.m. maybe. 10 p.m. yesterday and we like did not stop working. I look so white. Oh my god what plants do you do? We can't fit any plants. I'm gonna have to leave all my plants here no, you Good morning, Good morning. Well, Make me breakfast no, we're I'm hungry. I really like this plant. I want that plant to go, but I think it's too big. So we can't take this down. painting, so we have to break it down. Take it. I love this painting so much. I never finished it. I always meant to finish it, and now we have to destroy it. <gasps> My heart. My soul. God, that actually hurt. That actually hurt. What? It was hours and hours of work. My heart hurts. It hurts. So everything is practically cleared out now. Just wait. Just wait until you see our car. Our car looks freaking crazy. It's full of shit. Actually, it's not shit, but. We got rid of a lot. Yeah, we got rid of a lot. We have a lot of stuff in our car. I'm, I don't, I'm so tired, I don't even know what I'm talking about. I'm just like talking. Um, what time is it? It's 2 o'clock, so we've been working until 2 o'clock. Now we have to drive up to Sacramento and take everything out, put in the RV. What do you think, Burly Girl? Look at Franklin scratch my neck. He freaks out when people try to pet him. He just freaks out. He's crazy. He's a crazy dog. Franklin, you're crazy. You're crazy. So Jay has Franklin and Girly. She's on the seat. I. I have Willie and Callie, and the car is jam packed. Franklin's driving! Yep. Franklin! <laughs> I'm gonna have to zoom in on my, on my thing. 
Driving, 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 driving. So it is now 8.38 and the most crazy thing happened ever. I started running and I legit thought the cannibals were gonna eat us. Like I was so freaked out. So let me tell you this little story. So all we wanted was Taco Bell and we go to a truck stop. Now keep in mind, we're in an RV that is 40 feet long and our trailer is 16 feet. So we're just under 60 feet. We're really, really, really long, okay? We end up, there's, there's nowhere to park. All the trucks are in the way, we can't park anywhere. So we're like, shoot, okay, we can't get this Taco Bell. So we drive and then we end up driving and we can't turn around. So we're on a two lane street. We can't turn around because cars are coming, cars are going this way, like, there's nowhere to turn around at. So I was like, shit, okay, take this turn. And we ended up missing the turn. Keep in mind, we're on a surface street. A surface street means like a street, like kind of in the country. Um, the street had no lights, nothing. It was just like a street, okay? Just, just imagine like the street in the middle of nowhere, dark as hell. And our navigation wasn't working, so I was like, I was like, I don't know where we're going. Um, navigation's not working. It keeps saying this, like, to do a U-turn. We can't do a U-turn. So I look on the navigation and I see that there's a road that go, kind of goes like this and, like, does a square. So I was like, okay, let's go down that road. So as soon as we turned on the road, we knew we were in trouble because the road is, like, bumpy. So we're, like, bumping around. We're going brrr, bumping. And I was like, okay, to make a left, make a left. Dark as hell. There's nobody. It's super dark. We make this left and all of a sudden as we're turning I see that there's water on each side It's like a canal thing. They had like a little canal, but it was like deep like deep canal So Jay's like driving and then I was like we're like oh sh like we can't go on the street like it's kind of flooded Something just told us not to go down that street. So he's like, okay, let me just try to turn around so we're trying to turn around a 60 foot RV and trailer and each side there's water like a deep ass ditch water and it's dark as it's super dark like pitch black out we had to use a cell phone light and also on top of that we we're running out of gas we need that's the whole reason why we stopped to get taco bell and gas we wanted to get taco bell first obviously gas wasn't that important so we need to get taco bell and gas running out of gas had no taco bell and we're about to go into a huge ditch a water ditch and die forever so there's no one out it's pitch black dark and all of a sudden two cars start driving up and i'm like cannibals cannibals like i was super freaked out like legit i'm not even lying i was so freaked out so we get into the, i run into the truck and jay's jay walks and he like talks to them and i was just like looking and i was so freaked out my heart's like don't 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 i don't know I'm, I'm a chicken i have no idea why i was so freaked out anyway the guy turns out to be a truck driver and he was like a young like Hispanic guy. He turned out to be a truck driver and him and his wife helped us get out of the situation we were in and the guy was even like, you know man, I wouldn't, I'm a truck driver and I wouldn't have even been able to get out of this situation. Like he's like the way you guys were turned and there's water everywhere, like it was, you needed help for sure. Like I would need help. So we were so like, we were only there for like maybe five minutes not even and this guy happens to to roll up i was just like thank you god thank you angels like whoever like that's what you get for being a good person good things come back to you we could have we could have went into the ditch anyways the guy helped us out a lot and um so we gave him a hundred bucks for helping us and the guy was like what no i can't take that no and he's like you know like that's really crazy because like i really need this right now like, i really needed this he's like it's crazy that I'd run into you like this. Like it just, it, and it was just weird. It's just like a weird situation for us and for the guy, but we're glad to help the guy out because literally I was like gonna cry because I was so stressed out. Like when you're in a 60 foot RV with a trailer, like you can't mess around or you can't fuck around because you can get seriously in trouble. When we were in Massachusetts, we had to close down a whole freeway. A cop had to come down off the freeway traffic so we could back out because we got stuck so this is the second time it's happened that somebody's had to help us like back out oh my god 
anyways, that's my mini story of the night. Uh, we're on our way down to Valencia. We're going to um, stay at an RV park in Valencia until we figure out where we're moving to. So that's how that's working. And Jay got Subway. I'm doing my makeup right now. Um, we are staying in our RV right now. We are in an RV resort. I actually don't mind being in the RV at all. And we're basically just house shopping right now. So follow us along on our house shopping journey. And then we put some mascara on because it looks weird without having mascara on. So we are almost to the house that we are looking at to potentially rent. I will bring you guys along and vlog it. Um, we're super late. Like always. No, yesterday we were on time to everything. Really? Yes. I don't know. I don't know if you guys would be needing furniture with this stuff. Yeah, a chance of mudslides. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think there's been a problem in this area yet. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you guys. The one of the realtors there, she I never heard anybody talk like that. When I first met her, I thought she had an accent. She's like, and um, this is it's very trendy here. It's actually trendy. Um, yeah, and the views, the views are amazing. I would just live here for the views. I would just get this house because it's trendy. Like I've never, I always thought it like. People make fun of people for sounding like that. I never thought anybody actually sounded like that. My blown. So we have a huge decision to make. Huge yeah, decision. Yeah, huge decision. Yeah. Huge. 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 We have a huge decision. Huge. I'm at Taco Bell right now and I just got a drink. Tell me what the hell is that floating in there? That is disgusting. What is that? Look at the sun rays, it's so beautiful. Like legit sun rays, bro. That's so, oh my God. Oh my, oh my, go tight. oh my God. Go tight, oh my, ah. So one of the houses we looked at uh, yesterday, one looked like a haunted house in Laurel Canyon <laughs> and one was super, super nice that we looked at and we made our decision. So we looked at three houses in total. I didn't take you guys, I should have took you guys. I forgot the vlog camera, I'm sorry. But we made our decision on what house we want to rent. And we sign the lease tomorrow. 